Very good morning students and welcome back to the general knowledge classes. Our topic for the day is The Ferals of Pollution. In this chapter, we will learn about different types of pollutions, their causes and how they are damaging our environment. Number one, which kind of pollution can bursting excessive crackers cause? The answer is air and sound pollution. Bursting excessive crackers contributes largely to air and sound pollution. The fireworks in the air releases great amount of toxins in the air. It worsens the air quality and makes it toxic as well as full of smoke. And the thunderous sound are not good for ears. It contributes in scaring small babies, senior citizens and animals. Number 2. Should clothes be washed in lakes and ponds? The answer is no, because the soap and detergents used in bathing or washing contain certain chemicals, which can pollute the river, therefore leading to water pollution and death of marine life. Question third. What kind of pollution is caused when someone throws garbage on the ground? The correct answer is soil pollution. The garbage that we throw away in our homes to waste are produced at giant factories. The chemicals from these garbage can contaminate the soil and eventually the ground water we need for drinking. Question 4. Does turning off lights when leaving a room prevents pollution? The answer is yes. By turning off lights when leaving a room, you can save a lot of energy and reduce electricity demand. As a result, less coal and wood will be burned in producing electricity and will reduce air pollution. Question 5. Which living things help in keeping the air around us clean? The correct answer is plants. Plants clean the air through the process of photosynthesis. As humans breathe in oxygen and breathe out carbon dioxide, plants do the opposite. They breathe in carbon dioxide and give out oxygen. Plants observe sunlight, carbon dioxide and water to manufacture sugar as their food. Question 6. What is an object that causes pollution called? The correct answer is pollutant. Pollutants are the elements, molecules and particles involved in pollution. Life can be harmed when exposed to these materials and the effects of them on humans and plants are well known. Question 7. What is using something over and over again for different purposes called? The correct answer is recycling. Recycling is the process of converting waste materials into new materials and objects. The recovery of energy from waste materials is often included in this concept. Question 8. This is a mode of transport that does not cause pollution. The correct answer is cycle. Air pollution occurs from a variety of sources. Vehicles are just one of them. Each time a person chooses their cycle over their vehicle, it cuts down on the air pollution in our community and town. Okay, children. So this is it for today. I hope you liked the video and enjoyed learning about different types of pollution. So we will meet again in another general knowledge class with some new information. Till then, thank you very much and God bless you all.